Hi, I'm Garvin. Welcome to our telehealth video series. In this video, I will give a brief overview of what you need to know about thyroid cancer. In particular, I will cover what is thyroid cancer, how you treat thyroid cancer, and how you can live more comfortably with thyroid cancer. So we start with what is it? Thyroid cancer occurs in the cells of the thyroid, which is a butterfly-shaped gland located at the base of your neck, just below your Adam's apple. Your thyroid produces hormones that regulate your heart rate, blood pressure, body temperature and weight. Thyroid cancer rates seem to be increasing, which doctors think may be due to new technology that allows them to find small thyroid cancers that may not have been found previously. So the symptoms would be thyroid cancer typically doesn't cause any symptoms or symptoms early in its disease. As thyroid cancer grows, it may cause a lump that can be felt through the skin on your neck, changes to your voice, including increasing hoarseness, difficulty swallowing, and pain in your neck and throat, swollen lymph nodes in your neck. And the causes, so it's not clear what causes thyroid cancer. Thyroid cancer occurs when the cells in your thyroid undergo genetic changes or mutations. The mutations allow the cells to grow and multiply rapidly. The cells also lose the ability to die, as normal cells would. The accumulating abnormal thyroid cells form a tumour. The abnormal cells can invade nearby tissue and can spread throughout the body. Types of thyroid cancer would be the type of thyroid cancer determines treatment and prognosis. So types of thyroid cancer include papillary thyroid cancer, the papillary type of thyroid cancer is the most common, making up about 80% of all thyroid cancer diagnosis. Papillary thyroid cancer can occur at any age, but is most commonly diagnosed in people ages 30 to 50. Next is follicular thyroid cancer. Follicular thyroid cancer also includes herthral cell cancer. So follicular thyroid cancer typically occurs in people older than 50. And med medullary thyroid cancer. So medullary thyroid cancer may be associated with inherited genetic syndromes that include tumours in other glands. So most medullary thyroid cancers are sporadic, meaning they aren't associated with inherited genetic syndromes. Anaplastic thyroid cancer. The anaplastic type of thyroid cancer is very rare, aggressive and very difficult to treat. Anaplastic thyroid cancer typically occurs in people aged 60 or older. Thyroid lymphoma, so thyroid lymphoma begins in the immune system cells in the thyroid. Thyroid lymphoma is very rare. It occurs most often in adults aged 70 and older. Factors that may increase the risk of thyroid cancer include exposure to high levels of radiation. So examples of high levels of radiation include those that come from radiation treatment to the head and neck and from fallout from a nuclear accident. Personal or family history of goiter and goiter is a non-cancerous enlargement of the throat. Certain inherited genetic syndromes, so genetic syndromes that increase the risk of thyroid cancer include familial medullary thyroid cancer, multiple endocrine neoplasia and familial adenomatous polyposis. So next is how do you treat thyroid cancer? Your thyroid cancer treatment options depend on the type and stage of your thyroid cancer, your overall health and your preferences. So surgery, most people with thyroid cancer undergo surgery to remove all or most of the thyroid. Operations used to treat thyroid cancer include removing all or most of the thyroid and surgery to remove the entire thyroid is most common treatment for thyroid cancer. Removing lymph nodes in the neck. When removing your thyroid, the surgeon may also remove enlarged lymph nodes from your neck and test them for cancer cells and thyroid hormone therapy. So next is after thyroid cancer surgery, you'll take thyroid hormone medication. So levothyroxine for life. This has two benefits. It supplies the missing hormones your thyroid would normally produce and it suppresses the production of thyroid stimulating hormone, TSH, in your pituitary gland. High TSH levels could conceivably stimulate any remaining cancer cells to grow. 
and radioactive iodine. So radioactive iodine treatment uses large doses of a form of iodine that's radioactive and external radiation therapy. So radiation therapy can also be given externally using a machine that aims high energy beams at precise points in your body. And chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is a drug treatment that uses chemicals to kill the cancer cells. And finally, how do you live more comfortably with a thyroid cancer diagnosis? A diagnosis of thyroid cancer can be frightening and overwhelming. You might feel as if you aren't sure what to do next. And you may wonder what your diagnosis means for your future. Everyone eventually finds his or her way of coping with cancer diagnosis. Until you find what works for you, consider the following. Find out all you can about thyroid cancer. Write down all the details of your thyroid cancer, such as the type, stage and treatment options. Ask your doctor where you can go for more information. Control what you can about your health. You can control whether or not you develop thyroid cancer, but you can take steps to keep your body healthy during and after treatment. For instance, eat a healthy diet full of a variety of fruits and veg, get enough sleep and each night so that you wake feeling rested and try to incorporate physical activity into most days of the week. And finally, there are numerous products available at Lynch's Pharmacy in Douglas to assist in managing thyroid cancer more effectively on a day-to-day -day basis. So to start with, we have numerous products to get you up and running on a physical exercise program, such as exercise balls, floor mats, weights, and various other items to get you started on a program. We also have various supplements and products which we can purchase from us without a prescription, such as green tea and white tea, aromatherapy oils for stress relief, plus we also stock light boxes to promote relaxation, blood pressure monitors, blood sugar monitors and body fat monitors to monitor your health. So that brings this video to an end. Customers of Lynch's Pharmacy can avail of a brand new offering, a telehealth clinic, so you can book a 30 minute clinic with us and we help to increase your understanding of your illness. During a telehealth clinic, together, we create a cohesive management plan which enables you to take a more active role in managing thyroid cancer with confidence. We provide you with the tools you need to live a healthy life. Call into us at Lynch's Pharmacy in Douglas in Cork or call 021 436 to find out more. Thank you for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.